welcome to Pantech e-learning. In this video we are going to see how to run the student performance analyst project. So first of all you have to install Anaconda Navigator in your PC. Then after installing launch your Jupyter Notebook. Then it will be open in your default web browser. And here you need to, my code is available in documents, project code. Then here we are having two files. This is just a performance file. And here we have a performance with random forest. So I am opening this one and before that you need to know about data set here I am using the data set of this gender and nationality place of birth stage grade and then topic semesters here we have information of each and every student details and we have a class file medium low and high okay this data set descriptions also available in this text document you can just check it out okay how it's performing so using this data set only we are going to build the model so first we input some basic packages then we are reading the data set then we are analyzing the data set by using head function and save to checking the number of rows and columns and then information to checking how many objects are available and how many integers are available then we are dropping some null values then we are checking whether null values are available or not. Then after that, EDA part, exploratory data analysis part. Using count plot, we are checking the gender, how many male and how many females are available. And here we are plotting based on the class type. That is comparatively, how many males will be a medium student, how many males will be a low student student and how many high performance students like that we are going to predict by using subplot and then we are checking the nationality and after that we are checking the place of birth and here quad is the mostly uh, students available in that place mostly came from quad only and here we are using subplot and then here we are checking the nationality and with the classes medium high and low then using count plot for parents and then parents low medium high then how they are performing in lower level middle school and high school so like this we are plotting some EDA part that is expert data analysis part then after this part we are going to see how the performance of model is working so before that we are going to do pre-processing why because most of the data in the form of object type so if you have an object data type you need to convert the object data type into an integer or float type sorry integer type so i am using label encoder Using label and coda, we are converting our all the categorical data into one zeros and ones. So here you can see we converted. Then we are dropping some unwanted columns, and then we are saving it as a new hard copy of data set. And then here we are selecting a new variant selection, and we are predicting which is the important score value of my each and every attributes. Okay. then here we are checking a correlation of each and every attributes then after that we are doing classification so before classification we are dividing our data set into two types train and test fitting after dividing our data set we are going to train the algorithm using random forest classifier and using adapt boost classifier then we are creating an output accuracy score of both the model okay thank you for